Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Reductor, your Super Reductor to be exact, and welcome to a, uh, bit of a different type of video. So, uh, not while I'm recording this, but the next day, today's August 7th, but August 8th, it will be the 8 year anniversary of Five Nights at Freddy's. Now, it goes without saying, Five Nights at Freddy's has a huge part of my life. I have some, I have a FNAF poster and some plushies up there, but... Back in my early start on YouTube, I would make FNAF plush videos, I would talk about the games all the time, I would just be doing a lot of stuff based on FNAF. And last year, for the 7th anniversary, I wanted to do a regular FNAF tier list um, of just the mainline series. However, that one got messed up because I was an idiot. And um, I, I used uh, some other web, I used a webcam straight off OBS instead of having my phone set up as webcam so I can shrink the size, make it whatever size I want. But yeah, I wanted to do a FNAF fan game because right now FNAF is a lot about the fans with the fanverse stuff happening with that. People are like, people are looking towards the fans because there's not a lot of stuff happening with the Rainline series right now. The DLC is coming out in a, in a couple months probably. So mainly people are focused on the fans. And I myself have literally my last upload was a Five Nights for his fan game. Well, a Five Nights at Warriors fan game. It's a fan game of a fan game. But yeah, I want to do this tier list preemptively. So tomorrow this is going to go up. So in the video, you, when you're watching this, it's uh, FNAF's anniversary. This video is already going to take a while. I don't know why I'm taking so long. Anyway, we're going to start this. I, I'm excited to get through this because I'm going to share my opinion on the game. There's obviously a thing that says never played here. If I never played it, I'll put it in that. So yeah, we'll start with a Shadow over Freddy's. I, I haven't really played that per se, but I've seen enough gameplay on it to know it's absolutely terrifying and I hate it. Like, it's a good FNAF fan game, but it scares me, so I'm not going to play it. But it's a good FNAF fan game, I just can't play it. Uh, Baldi's Basics? No, that would never play it. It looks bad, too. Uh, what was this one called? It doesn't show the full images, just put- I'll put the image up. Uh, Bubba, Bubba's Diner. This one was alright. People were giving it crap, but it's alright. Never played this one, I don't even the name of it. Uh, this is Baby's Nightmare Circus, but like, one of the joke games. Never played this one. The actual Baby's Nightmare Circus wasn't that bad. Bonnie Similar? Simulator? That's an A. Case Animatronics. Now this is an interesting one. Um, I actually think it works better as a standalone horror game rather than a Final Nights at Freddy's fan game. Because yes, there are animatronics, but it really has no correlation to Final Fantasy Freddy's whatsoever, so I really don't know why it's considered a FNAF fan game. Although it is alright, I'll put it in C, it's alright. Chica Simulator, that's another A. The reason I'm rating the Simulator games so high is just because that these games, they're just fun to play. They're, they're high score based games and they're fun. Dormit Abyss, that is what it was called. Uh, this one, this one was also really good, you know. Day Shift at Freddy's. I don't know if the other Day Shift at Freddy's games are going to be here, but if this means the entire series, then it's the Day Shift at Freddy's series is an A. It's really funny. It's just, it's, it's a really funny RPG. Is it an RPG? Yes, it's an RPG. Uh, Eddie and the Misfits. Never played it. Well, I played the first night. It was good, but it was scary. This is, alright, so this is the Minecraft Entered Night. It's literally just the Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy Sister location. Uh, entered night, but in Minecraft. So however, however you rate that night is however you rate this game. What was this one? Fred and Friends Left to Rot. That was pretty good. Uh, I never played this one. Re actual Fred and Friends. That one was all right. Uh, ooh, what was this one called? Fre Fred Bear's Fright. Yes, this one was also really good. Uh, this is the. Fazbear Entertainment Storage? Never played. Oh, Five Golden Nights Without Cameras. This is... I. It's it's so classic. I love it. Without Cameras is honestly my f preferred way to play the game. It's really nice. Never played that one. Oh, fi uh, not Final Nights. What was this called? I mm, I can't remember the name, but this one... I, I liked it. I was really excited. This is Final Nights. 
I don't really know much about the other Final Nights games besides Final Nights 4, which is which is a B. It's pretty good. Uh, I think this is Final Nights at Candy's 2 3D, where it's like the free roam. Never played Final Nights at Candy's 2. Most people won't know. Years ago, I did an entire playthrough of Final Nights at Candy's 2, but I deleted it. The game's pretty good. It's pretty good. Final Nights at Candy's 3. Oh, that's an A. The original Final Nights at Candy's. Now, if it was the remastered version, I would also put in an A. But the original, that's a B. Actually, I think that is the remastered version. You know what, we're gonna go with the remastered version, where in which it's an I. Uh, this one, I forget the name of it. Final Nights at Freddy's in VR. This was the first ever time Final Nights at Freddy's was ever in VR. It's an A tier. Uh, five Nights at, uh, I, I can't really say it. Five Nights at, I'll do the Markiplier, Five Nights at Frick Boys. Uh, this entire game series is, is so funny, so I'm just gonna skip ahead. Uh, oh, we're gonna have our first S. S is, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna have our first S. I've actually never seen the third one. Or the second one, only the first one. Ah, oh, the My Little Pony games. They so they are literally just um, Five Nights at Freddy's, but with ponies. So however you rate the first couple games, however much you rate this. Ah, uh, this is a Five Nights at Sonic's game. I have heard of it. I've never played it, but the other Five Nights at Sonic's games, like Five Nights at Sonic's one, two, and three, that's literally just Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, ooh, Five Nights at the Chum Bucket. This one's a B tier. The newest one, uh, Five Nights at the Chum Bucket 3 came out. Uh, that's really scary. Oh, uh, okay. The Treasure Island games. There are so many different ones, I don't even know which ones these are talking about, so I just have to be safe and say I've never played it. If it's the Radiant games, Radiance games ones, definitely an A tier, but I've never played the other ones. Five Nights at Tubbyland, never played any of these. Oh, yes. My f one of my favorite of uh, uh, Five Nights at Freddy's fan games, Five Nights at Wario's. Uh, the second, this is the second one. The second one was all right. Third one, my favorite, my favorite. Uh, is which one is this? I literally, how am I supposed to remember this? Uh, we're gonna go with Five Nights at Wario's Origins because they don't have any other one up here. War Origins was pretty good. F the original one, that was pretty good. Uh, four, that was also pretty good. Uh, Five Nights Before Freddy's 2. If you've seen my video on the game, you know I don't think of that this game that highly. Although the original, that's a lot better. Uh, Five Nights in Anime. Uh, oh, Five Nights in Anime. It's just Five Nights at, it's just Five Nights at Freddy's with waifus, so rate it as you please. This is literally just Five Nights at Freddy's with Minecraft again, so rate it as you please. Five Nights with 39, another S game. That is so funny. What is this? What? I've never seen this game before in my life. What is that? Is that PewDiePie? What is that? Oh, is this another? Alright, so this is just gonna be another Five Nights at Freddy's in that. No, that's Five Nights with Hero Brian. I think that. I don't know what that is. Five Nights with Mac tonight. Never, never played any of these. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. I remember this. Uh, this was for, I think, the sixth year anniversary of Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, it was incredibly well done. It was, it felt a lot like a Scott game. That about to be. Uh, the Homer games. Uh, never played any of these. I don't know what that one is. The Jolly, so Jolly Bee. This is, this is Jolly Bee 2. No, this is Jolly 2. That one was, uh, it was alright. I didn't really play it. Jolly Bees? No, that one's pretty good. Um, the original Jolly, we'll go with B on the original Jolly. This is Jolly 3. Never played Jolly 3 Chapter 2. I haven't even seen gameplay on that. Five Nights at the Krusty Krab. That one's, that one's, that's pretty good. What is that? Is that another Mac Tonight game? I don't know what that is. I don't know what this is. Ah, uh, Overnight. This is pretty good. It's basically Five Nights at Freddy's 2, but free roam. Flumpties? Okay. Uh, let me just state something. Apparently, Jonah Chrome, the developer, got outed for talk for dating like some like 14 year old, I think. Like, why? Why uh, let me have my childhood? Regardless, the games are good. I'm not gonna like take down my videos on any of the games just because the developer did some bad stuff. But, like, come on, man. Final Nights of Flumpties 2, my favorite out of the Flumpty games. 
the original it was also pretty good despite the fact that you know i'll put this one at s i actually really really like the second game the second game is probably my favorite it, it has such a nice rhythm to it uh don't know what that one is overnight one this is just finds of freddy's one in free roam pork chop is adventure this one's also terrifying Oh, uh, but I've never played it. I just know it's... T is it even out yet? I don't even know if it's out there yet. Pop Goes? That's an A tier. I recently replayed Pop Goes. Oh, this is Five Nights at Freddy's in the GBA. It's Five Nights at Freddy's, but 8-bit, so... Uh, I don't think that one's out either. I can't remember the name of it, but it's definitely not out. Never played. Never played Super FNAF. I've never played. I heard it was alright. Uh, I've never played. I think this is FNAF in space or something. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure enough, though. Never played never played this one Fred Bear archives I believe it's called I've never played I was originally gonna do a video on it but uh, I don't know <laughs> I'm kind of stuck I don't know how to progress oh this one all right now we're getting into some of the Nixon games these are gonna be really good I like this one a lot uh the oh okay the joy of creation I assume it's the story mode that's an S tier game that's a very nice game I don't know what this is at all by the way I got those nights at Fred Bear's, I was so bummed that that got like canned because we have never had a good Final Nights at Freddy's fan game take place at Fred Bear's Family Diner. Nixon's as good as Scott, I think. I feel I feel in some of the games he makes is better than F Scott's. So I think that if he worked currently on a um those nights at Fred Bear's, it would be his best game. That he's ever made, and I feel like that it would. I, I feel like he'd make it so good that it would be a mainline Five Nights at Freddy's game. I, if if Scott ever wanted to make something like that, I feel like he should get Nixon on the team. Those nights at Rachel's two. This is just a joke game. It's a shooter. It's pretty fun though. The original Do Those Nights at Rachel's also pretty good. Oh, uh, what is this one? The Return to Freddy's. I don't really. I I never played that one, but I heard these are kind of bad. I don't know what this is. Don't know what the ultimate box night. I actually like this game. It's stupid because it's funny. Five Nights with Minecraft is a Five Nights at Creepers. I heard this is just kind of like a Five Nights at Freddy's conversion, but a little bit more to that. Never played. Never played. Never played. Oh, this is which Five Nights at Sonic's game is this? I'm not sure. This is Five Nights at Sonic's four. No, this is Five Nights at Sonic's four. I think this is Five Nights at Sonic's three. Which was Five Nights at Freddy's, but I did a little bit more, so I, I'm gonna put it in B. Five Nights at Sonic's Four, though, I actually really like because it's a, it has a little bit that's like slightly different enough. I don't know which one that is, or that, or that. I think this is Tyken Sons. It's Chipper's like, uh, Chipper and Sons, but it's like his little, it's like a son or nephew. That one was pretty good. FNAF World Simulator. It's just FNAF World with like set characters. I don't know I've played it, so... Oh, this one. What was this one called? What, whatever this one was called, that's an A tier. It's an incredible Final Fantasy Freeze fan game. If I had never played this one, I think this is called Insanity. Never played, never played. Animatronic Salvage, this one's pretty good. Never played. Fi oh, this one. Final Fantasy Freeze World Simu uh, Final Fantasy Freddy's Simulator, that's an S tier. Incredible game. Don't know. Don't know. Final Fantasy Freddy's Multiplayer. I did a stream with my buddy Jared playing this. This is an A tier. It's a shame that they canceled. So they remade the original Final Fantasy Freddy's Multiplayer. But then they canceled uh, remaking the second one. For some reason. I think the team disbanded, so it's unfortunate. Alright, that's Fusion Z Gamer. I have no clue. Oh, Five Nights. Oh, no. Here's the rem remake of uh, Final Fantasy Candies. Okay, hold on. So, A tier. B tier. Okay. Five Nights at Chuck E. Cheese. This one scared me. Uh, Radiance Team is remaking this one. No, not Radiance Team. Uh, Jeb Yoshi is remaking this one. Uh, Radiance Team also meet, remade one, which was really good, but I don't think it's on here. Whatever that one is. Oh, Jollibee's Phase 2. I never got around to finishing it because it was scary, but it was good. Sinister Turmoil Sewers. I never played, but I heard it's really good. Uh, the Web of Cog and Oil. This one's terrifying. FNAF World Simulator. Never played. Final Fantasy Yoshi's. This one's actually surprisingly good. It's made by Jeb Yoshi, which has one of my favorite Final Fantasy Warriors fan uh, games, which is uh, Final Fantasy Warriors Return to the Factory. I'm really, I'm still praying on that Return to the Factory 2 sequel. 
Oh, Circus Baby's Diner. I have a special connection to this one. Uh, because when I was doing my live stream two years ago, whenever this game came out, the dev, the uh, dev Obsolete James, I believe his name is, uh, whatever, Obsolete, had joined the, um, the live stream with some of the devs he worked with. And it was so cool to play this game alongside the dev team. And the thing is, my stream was like very small. Like, my stream was very small. Uh, it probably had like five people in it. But then he joined, and it was incredibly awesome to have him in the stream. I I believe he stopped making games. He was really going to make a Circus Baby's Diner um, custom night. But unfortunately, I think he stopped production on that some time ago. Uh, Killer in Purple, never played. Never played. This is Tenderland? Never played. Ultimate Custom Night. Ultra Custom Night, sorry. This game's insane. Uh, it has a lot of characters, but I've also never played it. Oh, Treasure Island? Yeah, so this is the one that Radiant's team made. That's an A tier. Uh, Chase Animatronics. Never played. Oh, this is, this is the remake of Five Nights at uh, Chuck E. Cheese. Uh, never played. Never played. Here's... Oh, okay. Here's one out of Flumpty's 3. That was a good game. I'll put it in there because it's a good game. It's a really good game. Now, I didn't think they were actually going to include this because it's separated from the other Final Fantasy Warriors games. Five shows at Wario's? Listen. I, I'm, you know, it's my opinion. I'm putting this in S tier. The amount of content this game has is absolutely ridiculous. I think WWW... WWW Wario is an incredible developer. And he's just like... Listen. A lot of these games... They're incredible, they look amazing. However, using the most basic of assets, he's able to make a compelling story and good gameplay in one for like he's he's really u making use of assets, which is why the which is why the original Final Fantasy Warriors series came out as often as it did. Because like enjoyable gameplay mechanics and like uh, efficient use of materials is incredible. Okay, uh, I forget the name of this one, but I've never played it. Never played it. Killer in Purple 2, never played it. Never played it. Never played it. Uh, Pop Goes Arcade. It's on Steam now, but I've never played it. Oh, this is, uh, Finance at the Chunk Bucket Chapter 3. Never played it. Oh, I think this one's Fazbear Entertainment Storage. I played a little bit of it. It's pretty good. Oh, this is, uh, Golden Knights... What is it? Golden Knights of Freddy Corruption? I... Of Golden, I've never played Five, five Golden Knights at Freddy's 2, but I've never played the other one. And finally, the last one on this list is the Tubby Land Act 1 Archive. Never played. So here's my list. Uh, feel free to do this list yourself. I'll leave a link in the description so you can do your own list. I think this is a really uh, cool list, and it just goes to show that none of these, none of these games were bad. Well, that I know of, because I've never played any of these games. But not a lot, a lot of these games were bad enough um, to warrant going in D. To reiterate, the only reason I put a shadow over Freddy's in D is just because of how scary it is. But yeah, I think that these games, I'm sure a lot of these games that I've never played are, are very, very good. However, I'm very, I'm very confident with my ranking of these games. And yeah, I, wanna, I want you guys to let me know how you would rank the games. And if you have any problems with it, don't tell me, because I do not care, and I hope you die in a fire. Bye. Oh yeah, and happy, happy eight years, Scott. I uh, hope you're doing well in retirement.